Hey everybody, it's Taylor with Boys and Grove, and today we're going to show you how to make a bunch of drink carriers. Let's get into it. I'm going to be making my carriers out of a two foot by four foot piece of pre-cut, half inch, pre-sanded plywood that I picked up at the local hardware store. It's a little more expensive to get the pre-cut plywood, but I should be able to get three carriers out of one sheet. The two sides are four and a half inches by eight and a half inches. The bottom piece is five and a half inches by eight and a half inches. The two ends are six and a half inches by 10 and a half inches. Before cutting the angles on the two end pieces, I drilled the holes for the handles with a three quarter inch Forstner bit. I just put them half inch down from the top of each of the end pieces. To make the angles, I measured half inch out from the center of the top of each end piece and four and a half inches up from the bottom. Then I just set up a stop lock on my miter saw to make sure that all the angles would come out exactly the same on all my carriers. For the dividers, I cut one piece at three and a half inches by eight and a half inches and two pieces at three and a half inches by five and a half inches. I use my cross cut sled with a stop block on the table saw to make dados in the dividers. I made sure to sand all the pieces before assembly. Once the carriers were assembled, I gave them another quick sand, puttied the nail holes, and then it was off to finishing. I'm using a 3 quarter inch dowel for the handles. We decided to try some different color stains on two of the carriers. And we used a two layer paint treatment on the third carrier. Then we applied a few coats of polyurethane. I decided to add bottle openers to a few of them. I got them from Amazon. I'll make sure to leave a link in the description below. All right, our drink carriers are complete. I'm really happy with the end result. We decided to mix it up and do a little something different with each one of them. I really like how the distressed look came out on this blue one and I left the dividers unattached because different bottles are different uh, diameters so that way you can fit whatever you want to in it. Here's one that Christina did. Uh, same distress technique, but she put a little phrase on it. Looks really cool and see how she mix it up. She's got some sparkling waters in here with some different decorations. 
We also set a number of these up different ways just so you can see how you can mix it up. This one we put a variety of barbecue sauce in it so you can keep it next to the grill or on the picnic table for a barbecue. This one we put some silverware and some napkins in just to show that you can stage it many different ways and use it for many different things. We even have one around the house that my wife uses to keep a couple tools in. It just comes in really handy. They also make great gifts if you want to stock it with your friend's favorite drinks or with their favorite barbecue sauces or whatever. It makes an excellent gift. Really? Now that's the Are stuff right there. <sighs> that's my shirt. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like it. We have lots of other projects over on our channel, so make sure to head over there, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. And we would love to hear what you thought of this project in the comments below. Thank you very much for watching. Be safe and have a great day.